Amrish attended secondary school in Tunis and moved to France in 1935 to attend university. She collected and interpreted Kabyle songs with her mother and brother, even earning a scholarship to analyze Spanish and Berber music at the Casa Velasquez in Spain. As she became more interested in the oral traditions of the Kabyle people, she visited Algeria and learned more about her ethnic heritage. She released her first novel in 1947, Jacinth Noir, Black Hyacinth, describes a Tunisian girl who belongs to two cultures and is one of the earliest books published by an Algerian woman. Her second novel, Rue des Tambourines, Street of the Tabers, is also autobiographical and reflects Amrush's childhood. Her experiences as a French and Algerian person come together with La Grain Magique, The Magic Grain, a collection of Kabyle poems, proverbs, and legends translated by Amrush into French. In addition to writing, Amrush performed traditional Berber songs in French. Her first album, Chance Berber de Kabylie, Berber Songs from Kabyle, was very successful, and she put out four more albums in the 1970s. These stories and songs helped Amrush preserve parts of her oral heritage and connect with her French and Kabyle identities. She was often involved in Berber discussions and co-founded the Académie Berberie, occasionally hosting the meetings at her Paris home. Today, a plaque celebrating her art is displayed outside of that house. Amrush dedicated much of her time to preserving the culture of the resilient Kabyle people, and her music and books embody that.